Hello, in this video, we will discuss who is eligible to use the lifetime capital gains exemption and what these amounts look like. The lifetime capital gains exemption, or LCGE for short, allows eligible individuals to enjoy tax-free capital gains on the disposition of shares of a qualified small business corporation, or QSBC as well as interests in qualified farming and fishing properties. When a small business owner wants to sell their business, a key decision can be to either sell the assets or the shares, as the availability of the LCGE will greatly impact the taxes owing from the sale. For 2022, the lifetime limit is $913,630. Because you only include half of the capital gains from these properties in your taxable income, your cumulative capital gains deduction is then 456815 So let's look at this example. Jenny Brown is contemplating selling the QSBC shares of her hair salon, J Beauty Salon, Inc., for capital gains on disposition of $1,270,500. Her marginal tax rate is 45% and she has not used any of her exemption in previous years. How much tax can she save by fully utilizing her capital gains exemption? I'll give you a minute to ponder on that. Since Jenny's business is incorporated and the shares meet the QSBC requirements, her tax savings would then be $205,567. And we get this by taking half the lifetime limit of $456,815 and multiplying that by her tax rate of 45%. If she was a sole proprietor, she would not be eligible for the LCGE. Now, because the LCGE concept is fairly black and white, both of these additional resources come directly from the Government of Canada's website. The first link determines who an eligible individual is to the LCGE and shows the rises in the deduction limit over the years since 2014. And the second link outlines which capital gains are eligible for the deduction, which we know arise from the disposition of shares of a QSBC, as well as the disposition of qualified farm or fishing property. So if you require any further clarification, definitely check these links out and thank you for watching.